Happy April, everybody. Welcome to Photography 101 with David Hancock. I am David Hancock, YouTube's photography professor. So for those of you who I, I hope are just, I hope you've been following along this series since it began in January. For those of you who are just joining, this is a series I'm doing this year, giving assignments out at a rate of one a month. Each assignment is designed to help you, regardless of where you are in your photographic journey, improve your photography, and all of them can be done with whatever equipment you have. So, with that, this is April's assignment, called, quite politely, Go Where You Suck. So, the point of this assignment is to help you recognize where your, your photos are weakest. And what I mean by that is, where is your work not good? Everybody has a different voice and a different style and a different vision when it comes to their photography. So, this, this assignment's purpose is to help you recognize that. If you don't learn to recognize the, the, the themes or the, the connections between your bad photos, you will continue to take them. So, for the first week of this assignment, what you're going to do is go back and look at your photos for however long you've been taking photos. If you've been doing this like five years, you don't have to go back the whole way, but look, look through at least your last year to two years of photos if you've been taking photos for that long. Pick out the photos that you hate, or pick out the photos that all look the same. All right, so what you're gonna do is you're gonna find the photos that did not do well. And that can be because the composition isn't good, they're boring to look at, there's something wrong with them technically, whatever it is. You're gonna pick those out and you're gonna find a common theme. Where were you when you did those? What were those subjects? Now you're gonna go back and you're gonna to try to redo that type of photo, but better. So for me, forests. Forests are the place I take my worst photos. I don't know why. I love walking in forests. They're my favorite place to walk. I almost never capture a good forest photo. So for me, I have been actively trying to take better photos in forests. So the learning objective of this is multifold. To learn how to recognize your weak photos, to learn to find the connection between those weak photos, and then to learn how to do them better so that you can improve. So for the first week, what you want to do is you want to look through your photos and you want to pick out the ones that you think are really bad. The second week, what you're going to do is you're going to look at them to find the connection. What is common between those photos? That common thing, whether it's a location or a subject or a style, that's where you're going to go during the third and fourth weeks to take photos for this assignment. And your objective at the end of this month is to have figured out where your photos are bad, why they're bad, and to go put yourself into that situation again and do them better. So in the second video, which will go live in two weeks, you're going to share your, you're going to have the ability to share your work either on Instagram with this hashtag or, and also on Instagram by drawing attention to me, by giving me an at, or if you are going to share an album in the comments section of this video, that's just fine. Just do something like a hidden imager album or some other photo sharing website. Drop a link and as soon as I see it in my withheld um, comments section on, on my desktop, I'll approve it. Even if I don't comment on every video, uh, every photo, I will look at them all. I'll check in with you guys in two weeks.